girls it's Monday night um, I'm not doing a topic this week or answering any questions actually no I am doing the topic this week I'm right but I'm not answering any questions life has just kind of been really busy and out of control for me lately and I haven't had a chance to watch anybody's videos this week so I don't really know what the questions are sorry um, and I'm sorry too that I haven't gotten to do a video Lately, I know I've been a, a bad point girl in that respect, but like I said, life is busy. I got a new job. I think I told you guys about it, but I'm not entirely sure. And um, Steph's looking for a new job as well, so that's taking up a lot of time, trying to work around each other's schedules and figure out who's taking care of Nat and when and things like that. Also, my brother's wedding is coming up at the end of the month, so we're trying to figure out you know, are we taking the train? Are we going to try to get our car fixed? And that we're a little iffy on, but we still really, really want to go. Um, as for a topic this week, I am picking my in most influential people. My daughter's crying, but she doesn't want to be left out. Um, and they would probably have to be my grandparents on my mom's side. And they took me almost every summer when I was growing up from grade school all the way through up until high school um, I would go with them for the whole summer and we would travel sometimes we were up in Canada, sometimes we were in Missouri, Montana just all over the place um, they took me to ghost towns, they were the ones who used to take me there and I really enjoyed that I loved seeing what life used to be like in those places and read the stories of the people who lived there and who who made this country the way it is so that always intrigued me and um, they were both also very strong in their faith and would take me to churches every Sunday and uh, try to nurture that in me um, I didn't always agree with their beliefs but it was nice having them supportive and there for any questions or anything like that and also my parents are very influential to me my despite them not being around as much as I might have liked when I was growing up it helped me see how I wanted to be I wanted to be around a little bit more not working constantly um, they were both working almost all the time when I was growing up um, not that that was bad because I still had a awesome childhood and they were awesome are awesome parents so I'm very grateful and very thankful to have them um, my older sister Kathy who was kinda or is kinda like a second mom to me uh, she's 11 years older than me so there's quite the age difference there and she was always there for me when I was too embarrassed or couldn't go to mom to talk to her about anything um, and then Stefan has influenced my life tremendously uh, being married to him and just even back when we were friends before we were dating he helped me through a lot of things that were going on in high school and stuff like that but he's changed me a lot and I feel like I've gotten better I was suffered from depression when I met him and he's always been there for me stuck it out through the worst spouts that I ever had when we were first married and I'm doing better than I ever have and I owe that all to him pretty much so and my last person is my daughter because she has tested all my strengths and pushed me to get better at my weaknesses so that I can just be better for her and she's made me realize things that I've wanted for myself for a long time and so I'm very grateful to her and I love watching her learn and grow and it's been nice to learn and grow along with her in other ways but anyways those are my influential people and I'm sorry that this video is coming a little bit late um, I will try to do questions next week uh, it, like I said it's just been crazy crazy busy here so anyways Tara I will see you tomorrow Bye.